in this video we have to make q the subject of the formula and here we have square root of p upon q is equal to r so we must have q on one side of equation and all the other things on the other side of equation so first of all we will do squaring of both sides now we can cancel square and square root so we have p upon q is equal to r square now we can take this q on the other side of equation so this will be multiplied by r square because q is dividing on this side now we can write this equation as q r square is equal to p then again we will take this r square on the other side of equation and since this r square is multiplying on this side so it will divide p on the other side so q is equal to p upon r square is the required formula and here we can see that q is the subject of equation